You know what time it is. It's time to get some food. Hey everyone, welcome back to another food video here in Las Vegas. Today we are off this trip at Palace Station. We're gonna be trying the Feast Buffet. Right now it's Sunday, it's 1.30 p.m. and we're gonna be doing the Sunday brunch. The prices at the Feast Buffet. Some good deals off the strip for buffets. So what are we gonna be paying today? The total comes to 18.41. I like the layout in here, it looks pretty good. But looks can only go so far. Let's see how the food tastes. Same plan as usual. We're gonna look around, do the tour, pick stuff what I like, and then we'll see how the food is. All right, so this is what it looks like from over here, and it ends over there. Start at the end at Walk This Way. Okay, so we start over here. What do we got? Different sauces, wasabi, duck sauce, spicy chili sauce, cantaloupe. You're already trying it, huh? Sushi. We got some sushi. I'm not sure what kind. Hot and sour soup. White rice. General Tao's chicken. Some ribs. Char su ribs. Chow fun, not looking so fun. Chow fun, not so fun, because there's nothing left. BBQ, some BBQ pork. I'm holding up the line here. <laughs> uh, what is this, a uh, spring roll, shiitake mushroom scramble, stir fry vegetable, fried rice, Mongolian beef. Ooh, that looks good. What do we got over here? Made to order your way. Flapjacks, batter, filling, toppers. Oh, that, okay, we're gonna we'll definitely have to check that out. Okay, serve during breakfast and brunch. So you pick all your toppings over here. Look at that. Go make whatever you want, custom. There's toppings, egg whites, brown rice, some syrup for your pancakes. Sorry. Gluten-free pancakes, potato pancakes, mushroom pasta, two bean hash. We're hopping over here to the the carvery. Let's see what they got over here. Scrambled eggs, and that's supposed to be bacon, making fresh sausage. Not here. French toast. Pancakes, hash browns, fried jalapenos, roasted turkey, turkey gravy, roasted ham, and pineapple glaze. Let's get a nice look over here. Fried chicken. Mini meatloaf. Cranberry orange muffins. Uh, what? I don't think so. Mashed potato. Moving on, moving on over to the blazing grill. Blazing grill section up next. We're just flying through this right now. Hash brown patties. Collard greens. Ooh, look at those ribs. Oh, that smell good. Pork ribs and uh, barbecue sauce over here. Let's see how the ribs are. Can I have some ribs, please? Oh, thank you. Jalapeno, jalapenos, corn muffin. <laughs> country, gravy, country gravy, country fried steak, biscuits. Carne asada scrambled. What do we got going over here? Omelets? Custom omelets? I don't know. Stuffed biscuits, sausage. It looks it looks pretty good. They got some stuff that's different than usual buffets. 
breakfast pizza and I love the strombolis at the station casinos. Oh yes, I'm gonna be grabbing a lot of that. Meat lover pizza. Uh, that doesn't look like meat lover pizza. Eggs Benedict. Cheese pizza. Pepperoni pizza. And now, just desserts. Let's see, where's all my dessert fans at? We got it. See, these are not labeled, they're all just kind of mixed together over here. Looks like we got some brownies, apple pie, cherry pie, carrot cake, bread pudding, vanilla sauce, soft serve ice cream, vanilla and chocolate, and also you got gelato. Beautiful. What's your, what's your favorite? Lychee. The lychee, okay. They got some options there. Looks good. And here's assorted desserts over here. We got some donuts, cupcakes, and uh, some danishes back there. Looks pretty good to me. It's a nice clean buffet. It looks good. I saw some things that I like, so. Oh wait, I missed a section over here in the middle. This is the salad bar. Soup over here. Watermelon, three bean salad. Cottage cheese. Prunes, okay. I don't think I'm gonna be eating at this section over here. Some, some fruit here. Got the fruit. Some hummus and some pita bread. And the salad is over here. And they can make all different kinds of, any combinations you like. Make your favorite salad right here. Okay, plate number one. Stromboli, oh yep. Hopefully it's good as uh, the palms. We got turkey, the mini meatloaf. Some ribs. Let's see how they compete to the Bacchanal ribs and the Win ribs. General Tao's chicken over here and Mongolian beef. General Tao's chicken first up. It's a little cool. It needs to be warmer, but it's pretty good. If it was warmer, it would be a good. I'm not a huge fan of meatloaf, but it actually looks pretty good over there, so. It's not bad. Yeah, no, it's actually, it's pretty good. Maybe a little sauce or something on this, on sauce. I like sauce, I'm a sauce kind of guy. This stromboli here is just calling my name, so I gotta try it right now. I don't know what's in this one. It looks like a chicken. Okay. And peppers. I mean, a fancy one. Mm. Mine's warm. Oh. They're always good. Pizza just looks okay. Not bad for, for a buffet pizza. Buffet pizza, you're never gonna find a gourmet pizza, but it's actually not bad. Better than it looks on here. Mm. It's, it's, yeah, not bad at all. So far, so good. Mongolian beef. Too much onion on that. A couple of the buffet videos, people say, of course the food is going to be cool. You're walking around filming. I walk around, I film it, then I get my plate, so it shouldn't be cool by the time I get here. Just clearing that up. <laughs> Some people are saying, oh, you're complaining it's cool, but you're just filming. Calm down. Haters are going to eat turkey with some gravy. Tur turkey's dry. Yep, told you. Yeah. Turkey's too dry, even with the gravy. I would, I would you know, skip that. The ribs. I've been waiting for the ribs here. I put some barbecue sauce on it. Obviously, that helps a lot, but let's see. What? That's why I come here. Yeah? <laughs> the guy over there just said he comes to this buffet for the ribs. You gotta put the barbecue sauce on it, though. You can't be the price. Like, it's such a good deal. I don't want to overeat too much because we are going for a steak dinner tonight, but I'm just 
Who's good? I can't stop eating. Okay, plate number two. We got some sushi, pizza, stromboli, beef ribs. I'm not gonna eat too much, so after this, I wanna try the custom flapjacks and maybe a couple of desserts because we're literally gonna eat in a couple hours at the steakhouse. So, yeah, but overall, the quality's there. It seems like there's a lot more breakfast options than dinner options or a lunch option for the brunch. It's a pretty good buffet for simple people like me. You got your pizza, your ribs. If you're looking for fancy stuff, then you might be uh, more disappointed, but overall everything, the quality is pretty good. The best thing is probably the ribs. Everything I just had at this plate is like my favorite. Um, cantaloupe juice, it's really good. You have them in these little glasses. I've already had five. And then you said that's your favorite thing here? Yeah. Fresh pancakes. They call it flapjacks. What's the difference? I don't know. Let me know in the comments. Chocolate chip, chocolate sauce, and sprinkles. Fluffy and delicious. all over my teeth now. So my thoughts on the Palace Station Buffet. It's pretty good. Stations Casinos never fail me. They got some good options. Um, like I said, I didn't want to overeat because we are going to the steakhouse later. I just mainly wanted to show you guys what they have to offer here. It's off the strip, so I mean, if you don't have a rental car, is it worth it taking an Uber? You probably could find buffets on the strip just as good, but Price-wise, if you're just thinking straight up price, you can't go wrong. Under 20 bucks, all you can eat, you can find some good things, one or two plates, and you'll get your money's worth. So, yeah. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe. Let me know which buffet should I eat at next. We'll see you next time.